to Jelly Belly Bean here, and today I got a Crafty Reptile Lovers package. I'm very excited because I thought it was going to come tomorrow, but it came a day early. So, um, on top she just has a note telling me um, a, a list of extras that she sent me. So, um, I think she said, okay, so it says Pooh or an icing cabochon. Um, some charms, some memo pads, samples of material, uh, some of her flower drawings, some of her studio clay, which is really nice. Because um, I'll experiment with that and try it out, since I usually use cold porcelain. Um, some eye pins and much, much more, it says. So, let's get started. Oh, my God. This is so cute. Okay, so... The first thing she sent to me, um, what is this adorable little Luma plushie. Luma, if you don't know what Luma is, it's from Mario Galaxy, and it's so cute, and it's pink, and she handmade this. Isn't that so adorable? Oh my god. That is so cute. It's really, really soft, and it's squishy. It's super squishy. she sent me. Um, I'm so excited. Sorry. Ooh, what's this? Is this a note? Oh no, this is uh, some patterns. Oh, okay, this is a pattern for the Luma bot, the Luma's body. And the other one is on the other side. And then that's the, just the eye. If you're gonna, um, she painted on the others. Um, instead of uh, cutting them out and then sewing them on, which is totally fine. So, those are some extras. And then she sent me... Oh, gotcha. Okay. She sent me... Sorry. I have to unwrap it. I'm really slow. And she sent me this, um, cute little donut charm. And this is really nice. It's really cool. It's, um... It's actually really well made, and the the eye pin isn't in a lot, um, but that's okay. You can totally fix that by putting a little TLS on it before you bake it, and then it'll definitely stay in, but that's really good. And then she sent it, and it was wrapped in this really fluffy, really soft fabric, white fabric, and it had this little lace bow on it. And then she sent me, oh, she sent me one of her, oh, jumbo charms. Oh, it's so light. One of these, a jumbo mamagoma, and has a little jelly bean on top. Oh my god, it goes with my name. And it's so cute. It's all painted. It's so cute. It's so light. Is this like, um, paper clay? Or is it air dry clay or something? It's so light. It's like lighter than my, some of my cold porcelain charms. That's insane. That's so cute. Okay, sorry, I'm freaking out. These are so good. Oh, she sent them all and she sent her charms in these cute little in these nice little bags. So the next charm that she sent me oh is this little cake on a platter. And it's really nicely textured on the inside and the outside is so textured. It looks like a whole bunch of frosting and then like um some micro marbles for sprinkles and then some roses on top this is really cute thank you and then she sent me oh goodness sorry and then she sent me another uh donut and it's like multicolored. it's really cute and it's like glittery that's awesome it's like glitter frosting <laughs> and then i am i believe oh there it is okay um i believe this is a cinnamon roll it's really cute. It looks yummy. Whatever it is, I don't know why, it looks yummy. <laughs> and then she sent me this really cute purple lion. Look how cute that is. That's really original, too. I haven't ever seen somebody make a lion like this. That's amazing. And it's like, um, it's like a metallic kind of purple, it looks like. It's kind of like a plum purple, and it's a little metallic-y. 
Sorry, guys, this might be a long video. <laughs> Sorry. I appreciate it, though, if you guys watched all of it. Okay. And these are some more charms. So, um, I'm not really sure what these are, but they look like records. They're really cute, though. And one has green in the middle and one is gold. So she gave me two of those. God, you're so good at making charms. They're incredible. And um, she gave me a little blue... Um, I'm not sure if it's an icing swirl or if it's a poo. One of the little poos, she said. And there are a couple of um, nail marks or marks from your tools. Um, you can easily just rub those out and then bake it. But it looks really good otherwise. And then she made me this little bunny, pink bunny, and one of its eyes is kind of smudged, which is okay. You can always um, sand that off. Same with uh, the eye pin is sticking out a little on the bottom, but that's totally okay. Because you're not supposed to see the bottom anyways. You're supposed to just look at the cute little bunny. It's like a hot pink too. It's kind of like the, I don't know how to explain it. It kind of looks like a mellow kind of pink, but it's actually kind of like a hot pink. And then she gave me a um, candied apple, which is really awesome. And it's sparkly on the bottom. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting like all like wrapped up in the little things. And then she gave me this chain, which is really nice, because I will definitely use this. I'm always looking for chains. Because I usually get really long chains, and then I cut them to the way the, the length that I want the bracelet to be at. So I will definitely use this. This is a nice chain. And then, oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness gracious. I'm not going to open it, because I don't want anything to spill out, but this is insane. She sent me this whole little bag of findings. And it's got, like, earring hooks and little, like, clasps in it. And it's got little bells. And there's another, like, silver chain in there. Oh, my God. That's a ton. That's amazing. Thank you. Oh, my goodness. This is way more than what I needed to experiment with. Jeez. So, she gave me a whole bunch of Studio Sculpey. So, she gave me this um, After Midnight Black and it's the studio sculpey, so it's really nice. And this opened, but it's totally okay because, like, seriously. That's awesome. Thank you. So she gave me that one. And then she gave me this, um, this, um, blush pink one, which is amazing, too. Thank you. And it's kind of like a bright on here, but it's more of a subtle, like, light pink, which is really nice. And then she gave me... To, she gave me a lavender one. This is really nice clay. Thank you so much. And then um, dolphins, or like a gray. It's really squishy. <laughs> it's like, sorry, I haven't like felt clay in a really long time. <laughs> and then some more charms um, wrapped in um, some more of the. She sent like most of her charms like in this cottony kind of sheet. So she gave me this um, storm cloud with the dangly thunderbolts. I asked for this because I thought this was amazing. I thought it was awesome. There's another charm. And then, oh, oh, it's so cute. Oh my god. She gave me a Yubu winged horse and it's like gold and brown and its wings are sparkly. It's so cute. Look at it! Oh my god, I'm so excited, I love it! This is amazing! Oh my god, thank you so much. And then she sent me a couple of these plastic insects. So she sent me a scorpion, and then she sent me um, a grasshopper. <laughs> she sent me this little bucket. I could totally put, like, findings or something in here. And then she sent me this other little bucket inside of the bucket. <laughs> and 
And what is this? Oh, some, um, she gave me some, um, stationery. Just some white, and then it's, like, colored on the sides. And then another charm. Uh, she gave me this little white octopus. And then she gave me, sorry, going for some more charms. <laughs> Got to get them out of the bag. I appreciate you guys watching this. Uh, she made me this cute little dino. And um, just a little reminder to get um, dust and stuff off your clay. Um, you can either, you can sand it down before you glaze it and it'll come right off. And then another tip is to have wet wipes by wherever you're working and um, wash your hands off. You should always work from light to dark and always wash your hands off after you work with colors. And then she gave me this cute little blue electric cat. He's really cute. And then she gave me this little Mickey Mouse donut. And then, uh, she gave me another little insect. It's a little bee. Or hornet. <laughs> I can't tell the difference. And then, oh, there we go. Let it open. Um, she gave me the little bunny with a blanket. It's really cute. And then, oh yay, 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 oh my god, oh my god, this is what I've been waiting to open, oh no, okay, so I'll show you a thing really quick, sorry, so excited, <laughs> okay, so she gave me this cute little girl toast with a little girl butter too, I have issues making toast, like slices of bread for some reason, <laughs> oh no, but this is really cute. Thank you. And then, oh my god, I'm so excited. Sorry. I'm like an idiot when I get excited. Um, uh, she made me this cute little dragon, and one of its horns did fall off during shipping. That's okay. I can easily just super glue it back on. It's so cute. Look at it. It's so detailed. I love its wings. Look at it. Oh my god. This is adorable. Oh my god. Thank you so much. Oh well, that was like a super thing that I'm super excited about. And then she gave me some yellow Play-Doh. Maybe squishy. I love Play-Doh. I like bring it to school and I mess around with it during class and then my teachers yell at me. <laughs> I feel bad, but I love it. <laughs> and then she gave me this cute little purple lollipop. And then... This awesome little snow cone with some um, micro marbles on top. So that is what she sent to me. Okay, wait. Oh, hey. I'm sorry. I just saw your note just now. I'm really not observant. So it's a good way to finish off a video, though. Oh, I gotta get it open. She sent it in this cute little, little tiny envelope. So I gotta get it open. Just give me a second here. I'm not very talented when it comes to opening stuff. I actually had to cut open the box before I made this video. Otherwise, this video would have been 24 minutes long. Yeah. It took me 10 minutes to open it. I'm so bad at opening stuff. It says, Dear 2 Jelly Belly Bean, I hope that you enjoy your package. I know I will. I'm sorry about my handwriting, but again, you're so kind and thanks and that's what made me want to trade with you. I gave you as many extras as I was allowed, so enjoy. Thank you so much. Oh my god, I'm so happy with everything. This is insane. I love everything you sent me. And she sent this cute little, sorry, I'm trying to send everything. And then she drew some cute little jelly beans on the top. So, yeah. Um... Wait a second, let me just give you an overview of everything that she sent. So, this is everything that she sent to me. This is an enormous amount of stuff. 
And I feel really bad because I did not send nearly as much stuff. And most definitely, we are going to have to trade again because then I can overload you with stuff. <laughs> not even kidding. So, this is everything she gave me. It's insane. Crafty Reptile, you rock. And you keep on making charms. You're amazing. So, everybody that watches this, please go subscribe to her channel. And if you can, trade with her. Because it's so... Oh my god, she's so good at making charms. I just can't get over it. Sub subscribe to her channel. She's amazing. Okay? I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'm... Very, very thankful if you stayed through the whole entire thing. I know it's, like, going on 16 minutes, and it'll probably be a little bit longer. But I thank you guys for watching this video, and I would be really... Sorry, I'm, like, shaking my bed right now. I'm like, ah, I'm so excited. <laughs> I'm, like, really grateful that she sent me all this stuff, and I'm so happy. And I'm so grateful. <laughs> oh, sorry, just covered the camera a little bit there. And I'm sorry I'm rambling, but I just want to say thank you so much, Crafty Reptile Lover. And I hope that all my subs grow out and they sub to your channel too, because you are amazing, my friend. And I hope we trade again in the future, because I feel really bad because I didn't send enough stuff to you. I'm not even kidding. I didn't send enough stuff to you. So, I thank you so much once again. So, thanks for watching this video. Comment, like, subscribe. Um, definitely go subscribe to her, and thanks for watching.